-hmm. Now, what happens when a jewelry designer meets a watercolor artist? They take the show on the road. Mm -hmm. Here's Swiss reporter Megan Kluth. I heard you guys are working away on lots of beautiful art pieces. Third graders at Homer A. Plessy Community School had the opportunity to make jewelry with designer Kendra Scott. You know, I hope that the kids today saw that anything in life is possible. You know, I come from a family of farmers and coal miners, and, you know, here I am, a jewelry designer with 39 stores across the country. My message to them today was dream big, reach for the stars, anything is possible, and just love life with your whole heart. Kendra has a special tie to New Orleans. Her spring line was inspired by local artist Mallory Page, a board member at the George Rodrigue Foundation for the Arts. And when we were designing our spring line, I was so inspired by watercolor and all the beauty of like the vibrant colors of watercolor paintings. Literally looking at Mallory's art every single day in my office inspired this collection. And so we just partnered with her. She and I have such a similar foundation of wanting to give back and help others, especially in the arts community. Homer A. Plessy Community School is a part of the George Rodrigue Foundation of the Arts, a program in which the faculty is trained on how to infuse the arts into every subject, and Kendra's line will be supporting their cause. Today I'm actually here also celebrating the National Art Education Association. We are donating a percentage of all of our sales on our launch day next week to this organization for arts programs in schools. She hopes her background in creating wearable art will inspire the children to continue their arts education. It was so special because they got to pick their piece and pick their favorite colors and all of them really did different things which was really exciting to see and they were so excited and proud to put it on. One of the children said that he was going to sell his for a million dollars. So yes. I just want you to know that it was very special to him. Well you know and I had another one who asked if he could make one more piece for his mom and it just warmed my heart and I was like absolutely how do you say no to that? Yeah, Kendra Scott has some really beautiful pieces. In fact, Megan Kluth wears them around the office here all the time. And if you want to check out her store, it's in the 5700 block of Magazine Street.